Shadow work. In what ways would you change how black men are seen in this world? Uh, if I'm going to go ahead and change how black men are seen in this world, uh, it would start by influencing young black men to voice their opinions regardless of what anyone says. Uh, to, to speak your mind no matter what people have to say about you. It doesn't matter where you exist politically or socially. It doesn't matter if I agree with you or don't agree with you. If you have an opinion or a belief that you have that has come to you organically through your life experience, through your own learning, then I want you to voice that opinion. I want you to voice that belief. And I don't want you to be afraid of what anyone, even myself, has to say to uh, uh, to disagree with you. Because there's, there's one thing that I notice is that, uh, first of all, I think that black men are seen as pawns, right? This is why they don't, this is why they come at you when you, when you say black king, because they want you to be a pawn. And whenever you voice your opinion, whenever you say the things that you believe and they don't add, uh, they don't align with the popular narrative where, wherever you are politically or socially, there's going to be a contingent of people on your side and the other side that come out and try to force you into their own space, into their own ideology by denigrating you, by trying to disgrace you, by demeaning you, by ascribing your beliefs or, or, or thoughts to, uh, to their, uh, presumed enemy instead of realizing that you have are exercising your free thought. So if I'm going to help change the perception of black men, I'm going to say and I'm going to continue to teach them to exercise their own free thought, to exercise your own form of expression. E again, if I don't agree with you, it doesn't even matter. Even if I think, oh, they're just going along with the agenda or the narrative. If this is something that you, as a black man, just believe, then I support your ability to say these things and believe these things. Now, if someone's coaching you and giving you the cues, I don't support that. And so that's, that's how I'm going to change the perception of black men. Speak your fucking mind.